are in Austria. First bus stop is to pee and we're gonna buy coffee. Chacha and I are together in Vienna. We're not in Vienna yet, we're just coffee stop and then back to the bus and then continue to walk. This is my bed, this is Chatti's bed. Getting ice cream, we saw a lot of people in the line, figured it must be good, so we might as well get it as well. So proud of myself, I ordered it in German. I am in love.
we've been walking for a while now, so it's time to eat and obviously McDonald's. Time to go sleep now. Time to sleep now. See you guys tomorrow for day two in Vienna. Hello guys, day two in Vienna and it's a bit cold today. We just bought um, breakfast at Aldi. Oh no, we just bought breakfast with Aldi, some confectionery things and a juice and some fruit and we are having our breakfast in front of a beautiful church. I'll show you guys now. So this is breakfast and there's the beautiful view. After finishing breakfast, we're gonna go see I'm gonna get postcards, but this time I wanna get magnets for home. I think I'm gonna get the magnet that also doubles as a bottle opener. So like you can stay in the fridge, but then when you wanna open the bottle, you just take it off and then put it back. I have my umbrella though, so I'm good. 
it's raining cats and dogs in Vienna now. So we're gonna go find a place to sit and eat. Yay, McDonald's! Always a good option. Like, we are Neta. And I'm afraid my shoes will get wet because I only have one pair of sneakers. So this is how the street looks like when it's empty because everyone is running away from the rain. Back. Um, it's almost three now. We've been walking since nine, but we had booked a walking tour. I'm already at like 14,000 steps, but I'm still gonna do the two hour walking tour. So kill me now, but I'll do it anyway. <laughs> so, next part will be me showing you parts I see on the walking tour. Back here again, there's the guy with the yellow umbrella. I was here yesterday. Thank <laughs> you. 
Remember we were here? at the end of the <laughs> of the walking tour so literally we went to all the places we saw yesterday and some of the places we saw today just that the difference now I know what the places are for and the history behind them and the last stop of the tour is the cathedral we went to this morning so that will be the last stop for the tour by the violin now I have to find the yellow umbrella
am at the Austrian parliament dinner. Literally, I'm at my wit's end. I can't wait to go back to the hostel and just sleep. So, I'll just show you the parliament and then the art house and go find something to eat. Otherwise, I've had enough. <laughs> I'm already ready to move on to my next location now. Let me walk a bit closer. Not gonna lie, in Tayanasha. Looks like there's a festival happening at the right house, so might as well check that out. Probably get something to eat here as well. house at the front, the tall building. So many choices, we can't decide what to get. We're literally going to every food store and then we're gonna go back to the ones we like. Where did you go? I thought you were going to the Indian thing. What to eat? So many choices. Looks like we found our winner, Korean food. We're gonna have noodles and duck. Here. Yeah. Finally gonna eat. Okay, I'll try. So good. Best duck I've had. <laughs> Talking to the camera. <laughs> I think there's a movie that's gonna play soon so the screen just turned on so we'll just check that out <laughs> the film is not starting for the next 45 minutes and it's really cold it's quarter to nine so we figure we'll just go back to the hostel because we are Banda and this is the only jersey I have. So back to the hostel base.
Postal time. That's the end of day two in Vienna. I just got cacao, hot chocolate, I mean, in the vending machine here at the hostel because it's so cold. See you guys in the morning. So I'm a backpack person, so this is what I hate about taking a rolling suitcase while traveling Europe. When you go to the U-Bahn, you need to take the stairs. Escalators are only coming up, which is good, but still, it's a struggle. And it's a lot of stairs. And I still have to go down again. Escalate, you see? Still have to go down again. Today we are spending the day at the park before moving on to our next locations. Yes, an elevator. Yes, my bag is still here. It's not going anywhere. State parks are the perfect place to kill time. And they're always so pretty. I am. I'm a budget traveler for breakfast. I get it at the supermarket, so that's what I'm gonna have now. Breakfast from the supermarket, and I have a view. Bags. Chet is having her own as well. <laughs> Looking cute in Vienna. Still at the park. We are taking the S-Bahn to the city centre now, we will wait further for our bus. We have moved on to a second park that's at the centre, it's called Burggarten, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right. Yeah, no the park is free, 
No, thank you. Ooh, a statue of Mozart. We have a little over one hour before we have to go catch our buses so we are now going to a, a coffee house to further waste time here is the coffee shop Last Ubon I am taking in Vienna. Now we're going to the bus station to catch the bus to Budapest. Stairs again. Okay. Bathroom break. Bathroom break. Yeah, it works. I just didn't have, didn't want to take the card. Wait. <sighs> See? Stairs. Escalator is nowhere to be found here. We're at the bus terminal now. Now I'm going to wait for my bus. It's in 30 minutes. Going to Budapest. 